What's up, Quangula Douches? TP was starting to go up again. I still think we're going to have a pullback soon. That's why I'm not going to put much more than like 5,000 in and play around with it for the swings. I was trying to get some urine at 7,500, but if we're going to have a pullback, I can probably get it at around 6,000. Um, if not, the 5,000 is to just make sure I still make profits. I have enough staked to where if we go to the moon again tomorrow, I'm still like, I got like, if we go to the moon tomorrow, I'll have like a half million over there, not counting my T-drop. T-drop is going to be my big one if you go to the moon now. The swings are to get even more, so I'm not even worried about it too much right now. But look, I have to go to base side and I want to get a pull day in. I mean, a push day in. That's my main goal for today. So while all that's going on, um, I'm hearing... Oh my, I'll make sure my meditation music isn't too loud. Hold on. This is a public service announcement. I haven't looked at any of the Sony Tiffany bullshit. Gorio, Moon Goddess, look, Tiffany, I kind of understand a bit more now why she has to wait till later to explain it. If you dump a CEO of a shitty music company who has rights to your music and everyone thinks is like, you know, supposed to be not a pussy, but is totally a pussy, you probably have to like, you know, jump through some hoops and all that bullshit. So I get it. You should have just said something like that. Not I'll explain it later and got my niece involved. Believe it or not, I've dealt with this bullshit a bunch of times before. Um, anyways, I don't want to get into that. Tiffany's the hottest. We'll just leave it at that. All right. So, um, what was I doing? Hold on. I'm setting up my appointments for the day. Everything I do is on my phone now, not even my laptop anymore. Anyways, so, um, look, the easiest thing to do, I, I'm, I'm seeing people talk about, like, what was it, that dude, Digital Dave, look, I know, I know these people watch my videos because I literally made an AI thingamajiggy about Theta Edge Cloud building a cyber sock and all that bullshit, and then Digital Dave did a video about, like, a less technical more people friendly version i don't give a fuck i do not give a fuck everyone it's a free it's a free platform i don't give a fuck all right what i'm saying is in that video he's talking about how a lot of people are having trouble getting onto or staying on binance.us okay i've been on by i told people back in 2017 okay coinbase uh they i'm allowed i'm allowed back on coinbase now but i still don't use it because in 2014 that silk road bullshit i'm not going into right now but that's where I learned about compliance bullshit. And this other Tiffany bullshit I don't want to go into right now with her stupid uncle and all that bullshit. Gumio, Moon Goddess, all that bullshit. But like, like if I didn't like you, if, if I didn't like you as Stephanie, who I met in 2018 and had Korean barbecue with and all that bullshit, I wouldn't be doing this, all right? And now that I think about it, how much do you want to bet that she got engaged because I matched with Sydney Watson in in 2019 on tinder and tiffany felt like she was not good enough because she's only five foot two or whatever and cindy watson's a giraffe <laughs> awesome just paperwork bullshit Anyways, look, I hate to say it like this. I would not I would not have like proposed to Sydney Watson. I would have like dated her steadily for like six months to a year and then been like, oh well you know, we want different things and you should move to Texas. I that's kind of what Tinder is for. That's also why when I kept matching with Stephanie on Tinder, I was shocked. I was like, the good girl with the beret and all that bullshit, but then like probably she got pissy and was like the other bullshit, the other guy she just dumped and was like, you're only allowed to touch me on Christmas and Easter and all that stupid bullshit, which is why she's been blowing my phone up. I don't want to get into that right now. We'll do that. We'll go into that later. Gumio Moon Goddess. Gumio Moon Goddess. Gumio Moon Goddess. Okay. Now look, the way I'm able to use Binance.us is I also have Kraken and Gemini. Okay. So, if Kraken is backed by the Bank of Wyoming, the State Bank of Wyoming, and gold and silver is legal tender in, in Wyoming, that means that your crypto that you keep in Kraken is actually backed by silver and gold. Not directly, but if anything was to, was to happen, because Wyoming, the state of Wyoming, has a stamp of approval on it, and because they... 
mine and dig for their own precious metals like silver and gold, worst case scenario, you would get some equivalent of your crypto in silver and gold. Worst case scenario, okay? Gemini, actually to stay compliant with JP Morgan's new rules because of the Basel whatever banking shit, just moved their customer deposit bank from New York to Pennsylvania. That way, if you get any crypto with dollars through Gemini and or Kraken, it passes the sniff test because it's already been audited by JP Morgan when it goes through Gemini. So JP Morgan can't come back later on and say you're doing something funny with the money they've already audited. That would make them look stupid. Now, wouldn't it? How do I use Binance.us? Very easily because first I put my money that I illegally earn through a W-2 that's why I tell people not to quit their jobs. That way, if you ever do get audited, you can say, I have a job. Where did you get your money? Where did you get all this money from? Oh, that's not a lot of money. I have a job. I have a career, actually. I've been doing this for 15 years. That's just some of my savings. I'm not worried about it. Check. Okay. So then you put your legally earned money into the bank. You then essentially send that money to yourself on a legally audited crypto exchange that passes all the compliance rules like ISO 27, no, 27,001, the FIPS bullshit, the HIPAA bullshit, the PCI DSS bullshit, right? They do that. You don't got to worry about that shit. If anything happens to Gemini, you will get the equivalent of your crypto in cash, more or less, unless you read the fine print because it's JP Morgan's involved, right? So if you just put your dollars into a legal legit exchange and then switch that to USDT or USDC and then you put that into Binance, that's all you got to do. When you do the weird shit, like send things from your wallet that, you know, doesn't have any, you know, like one time I sent some shit from my MetaMask and it took like six hours to come because they were auditing it. And probably because that MetaMask is connected to my Theta wallet, to my Gemini account, to my Binance account, it was okay. You only have an issue with crypto if you're doing something illegal. Very much so like regular dollars. It's not the crypto that's illegal. It's the actions people are doing with the dollars they're getting for the crypto. That's the way you got to look at it. So if you want to make legit money on crypto, you have to legitimately earn money, legitimately put that through a legal exchange so it's audited, and then put that in Binance.us. The people who weren't doing that is how they caught $240 billion of Tether attached to human trafficking about six, seven months ago. They're starting to audit the crypto, which is very easy to do. Don't believe me? Ask Tiffany's uncle. All right, Gumio Moon Goddess, I'm going to go do things that I can do without asking people's permission because I don't have a management team. All right, all right, all right, all right, whatever Katrina was doing. Peace out.